video the review on the Dracula and um hope you guys enjoy now I did luckily get the Dracula in a crate about 10 days ago and I have been playing it a lot in the new mode uprising it's been very fun all right we can go through the stats now here with the um, extra HP it has 13 25 HP it has no armor it has 2138 BPM 6.32 um, second reload, it has 155 millimeters of pin on its AP, 237 on its APCR, and its HE has 45. It's got 225 alpha on its AP, 190 on its APCR, and 270 on its HE. has a 4 second reload, and dispersion is at 0 0.353 with 20 degrees of gun elevation and 10 depression. Excuse me. It has 65 degree top speed forward and 20 in reverse with an average speed of 52. It does have very good acceleration, which is what I love about this tank. I love lights and mediums. They're actually my favorite tanks. Alright, now we are going to jump into the replay. Alright guys, here's the replay of the Dracula on mines and the uprising game mode. <clears throat> We rush the hill early here and get up here pretty quickly. Alright, so if you guys haven't heard, me and my um, friend Matthew's coaster vids are racing each other to 20 subs to see if you can get there first. So if you could do me a favor and help me win and hit that subscribe button down below, that would be so nice. Thank you guys and I hope you enjoyed the video. Alright guys, now we're on. Um, we have rushed the Chi-28 Defender. And I do make a few errors in this replay, like that, right there. But I reverse way too quickly. But, um, we do get another shot into the Chi-28 Defender. We are going to get a shot one more time, but we do take him out for our first kill. We are going to rush behind the heavies here, and going to miss that shot, we did get the bounce from behind. We were going to try to go up here, but I wasn't looking very good. Oh, there's a life We do get my HP back from that, and he does get taken out. We are going to rush back around here behind the like, hill area, and in the water, we are going to the panther before he gets taken out by our LPTP. I don't know about you guys, but I've been loving this game with the credits, the XP, the ability to grind the Grind tanks that, you know, stock tanks without your stats at all. It's very nice. Of course, my stats aren't that good. <laughs> but we are going to choose the Inferno as our ability. It's one of my favorite abilities, actually. Along with Supernatural Power, Jagged Shells 2. I like the Chain Lightning and... Buff reload, the second buff reload is pretty nice too. I think we actually get this battle. We do Inferno the KV4, um, but it's just the splash damage from my HP's max pull, so they only does 400 damage. We are gonna shoot the Lycan and he does miss. We are going to shoot the KV4 Kramer for 202 damage. We do, there's the chain that can do stuff. Did, I don't know, like 50 or 60 damage to us. We're going to shoot the Kramer with our Inferno. I, I don't know why that did 400 damage. It was weird. Should have done much more. But we do still do 400 damage to him and only get shot once in a 
We are going to shoot the rear of the cave before <coughs> that gets. Um, well, by bush guys. Oh, bamboo. <laughs> if you haven't seen this video, go check it out. He is one of my favorite YouTubers. We do get a shot into the lichen for our inferno for 638. We are going to mess up a little right there. We do get shot quite a bit. We are going to head around here and shoot the bulldog to it damage. <clears throat> Are gonna shoot at the bulldog and miss our inferno shot. Very unfortunate. We miss out the shot there on the lichen. <clears throat> so we're gonna turn around the other direction and head to the KV4. <coughs> We've got our Inferno loaded, so we are going to bot him with our Inferno and kill them with 400 damage. Because it didn't happen, but so we get taken out and we grab Rapid Fire 2 and Supernatural Power 1 as our abilities. Excuse me, guys. We are down 5 to 7 though. Now we are. Now it is even, though, 5 to 5. And I see the P43 PDR. Missed our Inferno shot on him, but we got that quick reload. We're gonna finish him off right there with turrets, with turret flying in beauty. We get 201 damage into the Bulldog. We get our 606 HP look back. We're gonna shoot Finger again right there. The bulldog is there, but he does in the damage. He gets one more damage before we take the point of our inferno for our fourth kill. We do, we do shoot the T28 defender once before he gets taken out by our lichen. Kills me in this battle, so I'm just gonna skip to the end for you guys. So. One moment. <laughs> Alright, we do win that. I just skipped to the end here. We have 5,608 damage done. We do. And we get... 112,000 credits for kills and 2,565 um, XP. But look at how much XP you're getting at tier 7. It's just like you have no chance. Apparently, the uh, XP done in this is actually affecting the um, <clears throat> normal game mode, so you cannot ace a tank. There's no chance. Unless it's under tier 5, then you can still ace them. Make sure to subscribe, remember, so that I can beat Matthew's coaster vids in the competition. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and welcome back again soon, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.